Oi! No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Hello again and welcome back to the channel. I hope you're doing well. Right, so today we have ourselves another mystery box. It's a vintage clothing one, but this one is a little bit special. On the 5th of May, I created a video. I reviewed a 50 pound mystery box on a company I saw on TikTok called EGJ Vintage. The video I saw looked too good to be true, so I wanted to test this out. As predicted, the box was extremely poor, very, very poor. It wasn't my cup of tea, the packaging was terrible, and none of the clothing met the £35 to £50 valuation that was stated on the website. Rightfully so, I was a little bit upset and gave a pretty bad review, I'd say, that this box overall gets a 3 out of 10. A 3 out of 10. A fair few people were commenting saying, oh, I'm thankful that I didn't buy the box or oh, I'm dreading my box to arrive and stuff like that. Another person saw this video, Ed from EDJ Vintage, the top dog, the, the main man. He saw the video. At first, I was a bit embarrassed because he seen me basically bad mouth his company for about 20 minutes. I'm not sure how he got my number, but basically he ended up messaging me. He basically was telling me how the company has improved so much since I bought that box. It wasn't true to how good the business has now become, which was, I, I was a little bit skeptical. I was thinking, okay, uh, what are you trying to do? What, what, what do you want? But he basically offered me a free box to show what how the boxes are now i don't really just want a box that's going to be juiced up so that it looks so good on the internet and that people are going to buy i don't want to do that he put his word across to me that it was going to be a genuine genuine box i thought you know what why not i might as well free clothes you know what i'm going to go for it i also have no idea which box this is we will see as soon as we open the box how many items are in there but yes one more disclaimer just just this box might not be as good as the box you get it could be it could be the same it could be worse better we will see um but anyway i mean let, Let's get into the box, I guess. So it's on. Yeah, it's, it's on, is it? Yeah. <laughs> it's on. <laughs> right, we have our box. It's quite a big box, actually, considering, and it feels kind of heavy. I'm just gonna rip it open like a savage. All right. All right, I'm not looking, I ain't looking. The one, two, three. Wait, the three home one. I swear that's like 60 quid. Oh my gosh. 30 quid's one item, 40 quid's two item, and 60 quid's three item. So, okay, 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 okay. Uh, shit me. Yeah, I'm gonna take out the first thing that's on top. Okay, we've got a little card, and it was packed by Pickers. Piers, Piers. Cheers, Piers, for the lovely message. Uh, thank you, thank you very much, Piers. All right, is there anything else on top? No. <laughs> We've got the first item. Okay. Oi. Oh, hello. Hey. Okay. It's a it's a football jacket. It's a football jacket. Someone's done their research. <laughs> Someone. <laughs> Deutsch Fußball. Is that German? I think that's German. Oh, it's so nicely packaged. Look at this lovely bag. Oh wow. Oi! No, 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 no. No, oh. no, no, no. Oh. What the fuck? Oh my god! Oh my god! It's so sexy! That is absolutely incredible. That's beautiful. Where did he. How has he sourced this? It is spectacular. That is truly spectacular. It's also great condition. Oi. <laughs> okay. Okay. That's sick, isn't it? That's, that's pretty cool. I like this one. I like this one. I do like this one a little bit. I'm not gonna lie. I think I'm gonna give this one a nine. What do you think, Jimbo Slice? That's on you. That's got to be uh, oh, on me. Uh, probably a, a nine point five, to be honest. Would you like to see it off me? What, Jake? What, what are you rating it, mate? <laughs> Sounds good. gonna get better or if it's gonna get worse we'll see but that is an incredible start recording if he comes in he's kept recording recording yeah <laughs> <laughs> okay on to the next one okay lovely bag once again what the hell I can see the North face I'm getting I mean it's good vibes okay Oh, it's nice. 
Oh, hey, it's nice. nice. It feels really good. Get a feel like that, mate. Oh, yeah. That feels like That's a good warm. thickness. It's alright. Feels quite nice, cozy. Good thing though. Does it look alright? Looks good. What are you giving it out of ten? Out of ten, for me personally, I'd I'd rate that like a eight. A, an eight, to be honest. That's yeah. an eight. What do you think, Jake? Shee. <laughs> alright, mate. <laughs>two items which are, are probably worth more than the box so it's a good start maybe too good <laughs> last thing uh cardboard oh, <laughs> 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 i don't i don't know i don't know what to think I really don't know what to think. It's not even a shirt. It's a shirt jacket. A shacket. It's not even a shirt. It's just a jacket. It's not even a shirt. <laughs> that looks massive, but it's a Patagonia waterproof jacket in blue. I'm lost. <laughs> I'm lost for words. I'm actually lost for words. Oh, wow. Stop aiming at my crotch, Jimmy. I can't do it. <laughs> I can't. You can! <laughs> can't do it. You can! Can't. You can do it. You can! What? <laughs> Zara and Sam. From... Oh, don't worry. Yeah? Jimbo Slice, you've got cool. good fashion. What would you rate it, as out of 10? Probably out of 10. To be honest, it's, it's kind of like a standard waterproof coat, but... Um, With the Patagonia. Uh, Patagonia, yeah, maybe seven. Yeah, I'm gonna, I was gonna go for a six point five. Right, time for the review. Well, that was a very uh, good video, I guess, to make. I enjoyed this, but it's time to review this box. How was the unboxing experience? Well, it was a box this time, as opposed to a bag that I got last time. I think I gave it a three last time, but this time, the packaging, you know, the bags, nice. Even has a little sticker on it. I I'm, I'm gonna have to give it Probably an 8.5 out of 10. We only had this one card, so there wasn't like loads of paper. I like, I quite like stickers and that sort of stuff. I think it's quite a nice thing to add to the box. So other than that, perfect, couldn't complain. Value for money. Well, is it juiced up? Is it not juiced up? It's up to you to interpret how you feel this box is, in my opinion, a possible juicing, or it might have just been approved a lot, and, and that's possible. If we're doing actual value for money, the products are well over 35 to 50 quid. Like, So I'm gonna give them a nine out of 10. I mean, I don't really know what's a 10 out of 10 if that's not a 10 out of 10, that's pretty good. It is pretty good. And quality slash did I like what I got? Yes. <laughs> There's now a preference fun uh, function on the website, so you're actually allowed to get a little bit more of a choice, I think, which is pretty cool. That's a good way to sort of give people more of what they like. Last time I gave it a 3 out of 10. I mean, it's got to be a 9. How can it be less? I like, it can't be. Overall, that makes this box an 8.5 out of 10. As I've said throughout this video, this may not be exactly what you get. So if you've seen this video and you think, oh, wow, it's amazing. I'm definitely going to get one. I'm not, I'm not promising anything. That's just what I've got. But anyway, that is the end of this video. I hope you have enjoyed it. If you have, please drop a like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you on the next video. Um, goodbye. Thank you very much, Jimbo Slice, for recording this video. Um, goodbye.